This is Umar Ahmed for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. Henry Turner is back in the ring this Saturday night live on BT Sports. See the smile on your face there. <laughs> yeah, I'm well happy to be back, mate. Five months and uh, November last time I was out, so I'm just glad to be back out, really. So, yeah, when you look back at last year, uh, I remember speaking to you uh, straight after your fight. How do you, how do you reflect on it and how many times did you kind of watch your performances back and what did you think of them? I've only watched, to be honest, I only watch them a couple of times. I watch them a lot of times to see what I did wrong and what I did right. Overall, it was a good performance. I feel like I rushed it a little bit. Uh, Try to take him out when all guns blazing at some points. But this time, yeah, just take me time a little bit more. Don't rush things as much as I probably did. Improve on a little bit, a little couple of little things, and just go again. Do you believe we are going to see that uh, on Saturday night? A little bit more composed, not rushing your work, and uh, also you alluded to a couple of more improvements. Can you uh, give us a hint? No, just it's over, overall. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. I've been a good boxer anyway, so I've had quite a big pedigree as an amateur. So I know what I'm doing. Just like sharpening up on a few things and that, uh, working on a bit more power in the gym, doing a lot more strength. Uh, yeah, just overall, just proving little things. Do you feel settled now in the professional ranks? Yeah, I'm every, every every single camp, I'm getting more settled and just improving a little bit more, slowing down a little bit. Because obviously when I, in your first turnover over from being an amateur, it's a bit erratic, isn't it? You? You look, you're still a bit of like an amateur. Sure, you do want to be back out straight after Saturday uh, and have a busy year. Is that what the plan is? And, and is that what you've spoken to Al and the uh, boys at iBox about? Yeah, the plan is to have another, hopefully a busy year this year. Hopefully everything gets better with the COVID situation and you can get fans back in and get the ball rolling now and get a few good few fights in this year. Seems like there's a, a real buzz at the iBox gym. I, I haven't been down there, but from what I'm hearing, etc. And obviously, there's a, a, some very good fighters down there. Obviously, Mickey's down there. Archie Sharp is, uh, is down there. And obviously, Dennis McCann, who's, who's doing big things. So it must be really good to be in that environment, Henry. No, the gym's buzzing, mate. You couldn't, you couldn't have a better stable at the minute with prospects uh, all learning off each other. You can't, you can't, you, I can't even ask for much more, really. I'm learning so much day in, day out in the gym. It's, it is unbelievable down there. Do you do much sparring with the boys down there? Yeah, I spar, I'm sparring all the time. We've brought a little bit of sparring in for this camp. We had Ara Davis in, yeah. Kay Prospo is boxing for the European title Friday. Uh, but I've been sparring like Jordan Reynolds, just joined, I've done a few couple rounds of him. CJ, just in the gym. Uh, I've done a bit with Dennis, helping him for his last fight. Yeah, I've done a bit with every, Michael Burke, I've done a good few rounds of him. So yeah, we just yeah, all spar each other. How was that with OD? Yeah, good spar, yeah. You learn a lot. He, obviously, he's been around the pro ranks a lot longer than me. But no, I had a good had a good spar against him, and it was yeah, it was competitive. And obviously, Dennis McCann, your, uh, your stable mate, making big noise uh, in the professional ranks. Something that I'm sure you'll want to do very soon as well. Uh, what did you think about him calling out Prince Patel the other day? I hope it. I hope it. I hope Prince Patel takes it and gets it on, mate. He gets himself beat up. <laughs> well, he said he stops him in six rounds. Do you think uh, that's accurate? Uh, he's, little Dennis is strong, mate. He's a strong little kid, so I think he could, yeah. Well, listen, uh, Henry, we should have best of luck this Saturday night. Obviously, we'll talk after the fight. Just before we go, what can we expect from yourself uh, on Saturday on BT? Hopefully a dominant performance, looking good and a nice win. Top man, I'll speak to you after the fight, all right? Thank you very much. Cheers, mate.